Hi, Jimmy Smith, Pelicans columnist with NOLA.com and the Times Picayune here with my weekly Pelicans report card. Pretty decent week for the Pelicans even before they played the Houston Rockets on Thursday night in Houston. Uh, beat LeBron James and the Cleveland Cavaliers. Lost a tough game, uh, pushing the Golden State Warriors in overtime. And then a furious fourth quarter comeback against Utah uh, with 41 points that pulled out a win uh, in the arena on Tuesday night. Power forward Anthony Davis, even though he only played... Uh, Really, uh, one game completely, and then part of a, the first quarter of Cleveland. We're going to give Anthony uh, and, and Ryan Anderson A pluses for their efforts this week. Ryan Anderson, huge off the bench uh, against Utah, and uh, was uh, a good, adequate, more than adequate fill in for Anthony Davis when uh, he went out with injury against Cleveland and then starting that next game against Golden State. Small forward, we're going to give Luke Babbitt a B. Luke's been playing pretty well. He's a an improving defender, and he gives the, the Pelicans a threat of an outside scoring uh, uh, possibility from the wings. Uh, Omar Ashik, center. We're going to give Omar a B-plus. He had a string of double-digit rebound games snapped uh, when, when Monty Williams started to go small against Utah, but still, uh, Ashik has been playing pretty well on the defensive end. I'd like to see him finish a little bit better around the basket. He's missing too many shots close in, and he's getting his shot blocked. Shouldn't happen to a seven-footer. Shooting guard, Tyreek Evans. We give him a solid A. Had back-to-back 30-point -back games against Cleveland and against Golden State. Uh, was driving hard to the basket against Utah. Just a solid effort from Tyreek Evans. Point guard, Drew Holiday. We're going to give him an A. He also had two really good offensive games this week against Cleveland and Golden State and is playing pretty well and taking care of the ball as well as facilitating. Coaching, Monty Williams this week gets a B-. Uh, some improvements in the rotations. Things are starting to settle down. Uh, Jimmer Fredette seems to be back in the rotation. Monty's uh, dealing with what he has, and uh, so far the Pelicans are playing pretty well. Join me on Monday, and uh, I'll review the week in the NBA.